Hello my friends, welcome again. We are in the part 4 now to create a Laravel photo gallery. And so far we have created this index albums page uh, to show all the albums we have. Uh, we can press a button and you click we go to the this form to create a, a new album. And this is out of style so I'm going to style this little bit and I'm going to add here a link to go to the albums not to go manually so go here and inside the navigation okay uh, here navigation links just copy this one and now the route is going to be albums dot index and the name is going to be album save uh, come here and refresh yeah we have this albums now and I need to style this form so we need to go inside the create blade and Maybe here I'm going to add the BG white and shadow MD and around it large save. Come here, refresh. Okay, it's a little bit uh, more beautiful now. And when we go here, I want to add a button that did this and uh, another one, another button to delete. Okay, this album. Okay, so we need to go inside the index page, and here when we have this manage, uh, add a button here, and I think we have a button inside the components. Yeah, we have a button and this button. Expect on the slot, the default slot. So, a button and edit. Okay, copy, paste this one and add to delete. Save, come here, refresh. Okay, we have this edit and delete. Just add some stuff, uh, some color. No. So, I'm going to give it a class with. BG green and uh, 400, uh, 500, and on hover, I'm going to give BG green 700. Okay, to so this one, west BG red 400, and on hover, BG. Red uh, 700. Save, come here, refresh. Yeah, we have this one. And okay. Uh, I don't spend it. Right, it's uh, refresh. And yeah. Okay, now when we click here, I want to go to the Edit page to edit this, and uh, we can or just add the edge here with to go to the road albums edit. Albums edit, and we need to pass an ID here, the, the, album, the album ID, album ID, and if I save, come here, refresh, uh, yeah, because we had only the, I'm going to add some style here, it's not not anymore the hex button, it's just an href, and 
for uf1 x3 save copy refresh maybe for and text hg save copy refresh okay one more we need to add the rounded Okay, I want that large save refresh again. Okay. And why is this? Okay, well, I'm going to leave it like this. Okay, so when, it, when we click on edit, yeah, we go to this to ID of 1, edit the ID of 2, and edit. And if we go to the controller now, so album controller, yeah, in edit method here. And you expect an ID, but uh, you know why I want to work with a uh, route model binding uh, album and the album. We don't need to find an ID here, just give it the album, and we have the album now. I'm going to return the view, and here is going to be albums. Uh, edit we don't have but I'm going to create this one and we need a comp compact and album save and inside the resources views albums create a new file here uh, call it edit blade.php okay and when you have the create form just copy it and pass it here okay update update uh, album cool now here the album title we don't need this okay albums update and here we put the album id okay and save or oh, not yet because here we need to pass the the value so because this, if I save now, come here, uh, refresh. Yeah, we have this, but we don't know what value is here. So, and update album, and album title, okay. Uh, add the value here, and we can add the old method, and then the title, or the default is going to be the album. Title save, come here, refresh. Yeah, we have this U USA now. And before we hit that button, just you know, here we are. When we expect an ID, I'm just going to copy this one and pass it here. Okay, so we have now the album and the album update. And the title is going to be the request title. Okay. And I'm going to return the 
redirect to the road of uh, albums index. Yeah. Save. Uh, come here, refresh. Yeah. Sorry. Refresh here and update it. If I create now, the post method is not support yet. Sorry. My mistake. Refresh again just in any case. When we hit the edit first, we need to add here because the method is going to is post, we're going to override this and it's going to be method. Oh. Save come back. Yeah, refresh again and we had that USA updated and USA updated okay uh, one more thing I got it watch out now we don't need this script to create but update a uh, small change update come here refresh yeah update and update it okay uh, now we want I want to when we click here to delete this and if I go to the index page here I don't want the button or just copy this or cut this and I want the form here and method post and action is going to be the route to delete the map the and when we albums where are destroyer destroy we need to pass the album ID there okay uh, close the form and add the CSR token okay and I'll override the method is going to be delete and we need to pass the button now delete Okay, if I save now, uh, go to the album, and when we have this destroy, just remove this ID and add the road model money album to the album, and album delete. Okay, and I'm going to turn the drag back or just return or redirect back, save and come here, refresh. And I think, oh, yeah, well, uh, because we made change here now. We have this, and I need to add a class here. Oh, uh, sorry, a div with a class of a flex, and okay, save, come here, refresh. Yeah, flex. Uh, Justify uh, around. Save. Okay. And when we hit the delete button, if I do justify center, okay. 
Oké, okay. jij bad is naar de... Dit is het En we need that. Um, maybe. Uh, margin of two. Say, come here, refresh. And not so good. Three. Okay, why is this? It's not looking good. One above. Just uh, to see if, if the delete button is uh, work. If I click, yeah, we delete it. Click again. We delete it. Click again. Yeah. I'm going to fix the display the style here and see you in the next video.